back outside because of our old friend Rexy, but maybe we can get the lights on. It seems like those things, whatever they are, like to stick to the shadows. We're in luck. This looks like a power panel right here. Oh, wrong button. Oh, oh. It kind of scared me. What's the holdup? It's nothing. It's just a different uh, model than I'm used to, is all. So, you're stuck. Hmm. What's that? What about that thing there? Maybe you have to prime it before turning it on, like an oil pump or something. <laughs> Look, no offense, but this type of electrical system is probably way ahead of anything you've seen before. I got this. What about the instructions? The instructions? They're right there, no? Relax. This thing is just a glorified fuse box. Push to close, push to open. If I remember back in school, that there was like a little thing that like opens up the um, the power circuit that like turns off things, and then when you close the circuit, it goes into a loop that turns on. So push to close. Push to close. Close what? Well, like, that was my best guess. Well, so I can press it, press it again. Nothing happened. Why didn't something happen? Maybe uh, it's already on. I got it now. Close your eyes. You're about to lose your sights. <laughs> Night vision. Uh oh. What's going on? Dad? Over here, Jess. It's all right. The backup generator wasn't meant to last this long, that's all. No, that's not it. We should have been fine for days. How the hell was I supposed to know open meant turn everything off? I mean, it's counterintuitive. You would know if you read the instructions. Why don't you yell a little louder? I think there's a dinosaur on the other side of the island that didn't hear you. Jeez. <laughs> Whatever. There's a close, right? All right. Close a close, right? <laughs> close that crap right up. Yeah, that's right. Who is your... Oh, oh, come on. Oh, what? Ah, uh, we're doomed. Oh, it's us. Rocket Jurassic Park's only unofficial radio station. Just a reminder before we sign off, Parklings, if you're not on the boat by 7, you're not going to be on the boat at all. I've got a little something special for all you last-minute packers out there. Personal favorite of mine, and I'll see you all on board. Damn it, Artie. <laughs> He's not still here, is he? No. From the sound of it, he queued up this last bit of tape and took off. So here's a little something to get you ready to set sail. <laughs> oh man, what are we doing? What are we doing? What are we doing? Whoa. Great job. Damn. What? Oh, oh, oh. But I did it. Punch it. Whoa. Come on, what are we doing? <laughs> Sliding raptor. Whoa. You killed a raptor with a knife. You what the hell? That way. 
name I that mean, tune. The show is over. Laura, you are my new favorite person. <laughs> You've forgiven me for fixing the lysine problem? Don't no. Don't push it. Holy crap, Oscar. Did you just take one of those things out by hand? Why are you here? Look who's up. Why are you here? You're supposed to be at the crash site. Yeah, uh, the plan didn't factor in an angry T-Rex, so we had to change it. I didn't think to engage it in a knife fight, sorry. We have to change the plan. That's right. I unlocked the mystery behind the shaving cream can. Turns out, little Miss Sunshine here is smuggling dino embryos off the island. What? Embryos you? I know that look. Let me guess. You have a plan. Yeah, well, turns out these things are worth a lot of money to the right people. I mean, a lot. Hypocrite. <laughs> uh, let me call you hypocrite. <laughs> You're pretty self-righteous for a thief. I wouldn't be a thief if you hadn't stolen this island from my people in the first place. I didn't steal anything. The Costa Rican government rented this place to InGen. And you did their dirty work, didn't you? I did my job. Just like I'm doing now. Really? And how many people are you going to kill today? Shut the hell up, or I'll start counting with you. Whoa, whoa, no fighting. Save it for the dinos, huh? You're gonna do it? You going along with her? Hey, I'm not doing anything unless you're down. But come on, Oscar. Do you really think InGen gives a rat's ass about us? Look what happened to B-Team, to Decaf. Their families are gonna get a puny check, a gag order, and nothing. Ambulance in the background. I won't leave them. Do I gotta remind you we're working against the clock? There's no time to save these people and be her errand boys before this place turns to ground zero. What do you mean ground zero? Nothing. We could do it, Oscar. We've got a call for another helicopter anyway, so one of us takes the eggheads back to the mainland and the other takes her to meet her contact. Let me guess. That last part would be up to you. You just tell Injian that I bought it like the rest of the guys they sent. Then you and I hook up later to split our cut. I trust you. But I don't trust her. I'll think about it. I'm in. Hell no. Hell no. I'm gonna save the people. Look, Billy. If you want to bail, that's your business. But I was hired to do a job. And I'm gonna do it. Oh, come on, Oscar. It doesn't have to be that way. Finishing the job is part of the plan. And so is screwing our employer. Too risky. I won't rat you out. But I don't want that kind of heat. I'm sorry you feel that way, man. Let me know if you change your mind. All right, let's move out. Take it slow and quiet. Hey, bitch. <laughs> let's not start there this we go. again. <laughs> I respect your opinion, Jerry. Just what are you honest? doing? I'm a little surprised at your lack of regard for the animals. It's not that I don't care about them, Laura. It's just there are so many unintended consequences that come with your decision. Oh, you're gonna smoke now, 14-year-old? Shit. Laura. We need contingency plans. <laughs> we'll need to monitor things outside of the park. Where is it? I know it. <laughs> yes. Wow, you're a thief. <gasps> it's there. Oh, he ate the cigarettes. Yeah, run! Yeah. What's wrong? What happened? They're there. <laughs> Got it. Uh oh, three more. Or two more. Ooh. Get away if you can! Go! I can't keep this up alone! Ooh. Oof. Key. Got it. Yes! Reverse! Oh. Ah. Shh. So I didn't mess that up. <laughs> Whoa, this is crazy. Do it. Take care of business. 
Your last friend wasn't so lucky. Wow. <laughs> Oscar, you're a boss. <laughs> Amazing. I've never seen them afraid before. You're getting good at this, Jess. <laughs> I'm proud of you. Thanks, Dad. Stopping the stalkers. That was awesome. He's bloody. Do you see okay, those hands? Hunt. Let the man breathe. Yoder! You're alive! We're alive? I'm surprised you guys lasted five minutes without me and Oscar. Thank you. Forget it. Is that blood? Oh my god, you're bleeding. Are you okay? No worries. Belongs to one of them. You killed one? You killed one of them? With a knife? That's so badass. Well, <laughs> hey, I outran a T-Rex. It's nothing. Just another fight. Raptor attack too. How did you survive? How'd you get so tough? So you're gonna wrap. So you're gonna get a raptor tattoo? Are you gonna get a tattoo of a raptor now? I totally would. Hmm. Not a bad idea. You aren't fooling me. What now? You can pretend to be a hero all you want, but we both know what you really are. You're right. We do. Whoa. <laughs> Uh-oh. Everyone, we have a problem. What's the problem? What's wrong, Laura? You've seen the flickering lights, now the steam eruptions. Something's gone wrong with the island's geothermal power plant. That's not our problem. When the power plant explodes, it will be. It's that bad? Everything I've read about the system says it's supposed to shut itself down if something goes wrong with the steam pressure. The fact that it hasn't means that the pressure will build unchecked. It'll pop like a balloon and take half the island with it. How do, how do we get there? Can we get to the power plant from here? I'm completely turned around. Yes, I've been here before. It's down this way. We really ought to get moving. Why the power plant? I'm sure the power plant is the problem. It's the steam that clinches it for me, Jerry. The power could fail for a lot of reasons, but the steam comes straight from the power plant. How do we fix it? How can we stop the power plant from exploding? We have to do something, and quickly, but I won't know exactly what until we get there. No time. Say goodbye to your dinosaurs, Doc. You can dig up the fossils later. When the power plant explodes, it'll take us with it. Unless you have a spare helicopter ready to lift off. Oh, this just keeps getting better and better. Listen up. You're gonna show me the corridor that goes to the power plant. I'm gonna scout ahead and make sure there's no dinosaur party happening when we get there. Can I come? I know I can help. You're staying right here where I can keep an eye on you. Hey, I saved you, remember? Besides, those things are afraid of him. You wandered off, Jess. Oscar doesn't mind, do you? Oscar? Where'd he go? Hmm. I'm glad you guys live. I outran a T-Rex too. I'm glad you guys lived. When I saw the helicopter crash into the jungle, I thought you guys were goners. We're fine. Hey, uh, about before, the hostage thing? I'm sorry. I was only trying to protect myself. Me and the Mercs, we worked it out. Worked it out? How? Don't worry about it. We're okay. For now. I outran a T-Rex too. You outran a T-Rex, huh, Yoder? I sure did. You know, not everyone has the training to pull something like that off, let alone the raw speed. I know, right? That's what I thought when I outran her yesterday. So you're friends. That's great! So everyone's friends now, huh? <laughs> I wouldn't put it like that. Then how would you... <gasps> no way! Did you guys make out? <laughs> We've decided that we can all work together. Let's put it that way. Hey, Oscar's back. 